Hello, we're back for another video on the Arkfielder map. Going to be showing you a quick video on how to find the locations of every single boss terminal on the map. There's a lot more bosses on this map than comparing to all the other Ark maps. We got three world mini bosses, we got the three original island bosses, and we got the main boss from the Fjorder map. So, to be able to summon the Fjorder final boss, you need to have completed the boss fights from the original island map. And to complete those three, you need to have completed the boss fights from all three world mini bosses so without further ado let's get straight into showing you where you will find them all so i will show you the mini boss locations first location of the cave to baylor's terminal is 3.8 latitude 47.5 longitude is our location on the map you can't see because my fingers in the way we're right at the top of the map you can see the ocean is right behind me here so we're very close to that right on the edge of the cliff so you just want to go in here just a path leading straight down. Be careful because there is high level spawns in here like dire bears and stuff. So you need to watch out for them. But uh, here's the terminal here. And all you need is 30 rune zones to summon these bosses. Which of course you will gain from killing alpha predators. Once killed you will receive the all important Baylor's Relic. To find the mini boss Steinbjorn, I'm not sure if I pronounced that right, you'll need to teleport to Jotunheim. You can do this in two ways, you can either go to the portal room located at 40.7 latitude, 57.5 longitude. Here's our location on the map. Looking for this big opening here, this is the front of the cave, you just want to go through here. You'll be met with the portal room. Vanaheim on the left, Asgard in the middle, and Jotunheim on the right. So you need to go to Jotunheim. This actually brings you very close to the terminal. The terminal is pretty close to where you spawn in for the obelisk. If you just go up from here, you want to look to the north. There is a pathway going towards this way. You want to follow this pathway all the way until you see these big skeleton bones. Break off to the right when you get to here. And you're looking for this lake here. Just go into the lake. And there's a little cave just through here. Coordinates to the entrance of this cave, 77.4 latitude, 31.0 longitude. There's our location on the map. Let's go straight in. There is only one way through, so you won't have trouble finding it once you're in. Look for this terminal here. Of course, you need 30 rune stones once again to summon Steinbjorn. And once slain, same again. Access the inventory, you get some loot, and you get the Steinbjorn relic. That's what we need. To find Hattie and Skull, not sure if my pronunciation is correct on that one either. From the portal room, you want to go to Asgard, which is the one in the middle. Once in Asgard, once you got from the obelisk, you want to head northeast underneath this archway. First mount mini mountain you see is just on the left here. Located at 20.5 latitude, 37.4 longitude. Location on the map. If you're looking for a quick way to teleport via the survivor teleportation menu, you want to go to Asgard Northeast. This will take you right outside the terminal. And if we just go up from here, you can see terminal is just there, right next to where we teleported in. That's the same, putting your rune stones in, and you're getting to summon. And of course this is two mini bosses, so you will need trophies from both of them. That's the same again, access inventory. You can Get the Hattie Relic. Skull Relic. Once you have completed all three mini bosses, you're ready to do the three normal bosses from the island map. The Brew Bubba Terminal. Cave entrance is located at 57.7 latitude, 65.4 longitude. Is our location on the map. Right next to the beach here. It's quite hidden behind these trees here. Just want to go straight in. It's a very small cave, easy to see. You're just looking for this tree up here on the left, and that's where the terminal is. Once you head in. And of course, Gamma, Beta, Alpha, they will all unlock Tech Engrams for you, just like the original boss fights from the map. It's the same as the original map. Selection of artifacts and the Beta Relic for Gamma. Selection of artifacts, Relic and Trophies for Beta and Alpha. Once killing each boss from the island map, you will be rewarded with the trophy you completed the difficulty on, the flag for the boss fight, and a nice amount of element. Megapithecus Terminal Cave location is located at 57.3 latitude, 85.3 longitude. Here's our location on the map. Right next to the beach also. I'm gonna head straight into this cave. 
There are two paths to take. Following the one up to the left will give you the quickest route to the terminal, which is just here by this radiated water. And that is where you'll find your Mega Pivacus Terminal, Gamma, Beta, Alpha, same again. Steinbjorn Relic is needed and you'll be rewarded with the same rewards, a trophy you completed the difficulty on, the flag for the boss fight and a nice amount of element. And to find the Dragon Terminal, you're looking for the cave entrance, 86.3 latitude, 4.5 longitude. Here's our location on the map, bottom left, right next to the beach once again. And then you just want to go straight in, it's very close to the entrance, which is very nice, just here on the left. And it's the same again, you just need the Hattie and Skull relics from these, selection of artifacts and trophies from random creatures. And of course you'll be rewarded with the Dragon Trophy, the flag for the boss fight, and a nice amount of element. Then we can move on to the main boss. And to fight the final boss, you can do this from each obelisk on the map, the blue, red, and the green and of course each difficulty requires the trophies from the previous boss fights that you completed so depending on what final boss you want to do it on assuming gamma you need to do all of these on gamma to be able to get every single trophy needed for the final boss fight and that is where you will find all your boss fight terminals and how to summon them all i hope it helps you all i'll catch you all in the next one take care goodbye